guys I hope you're having a great day welcome to my channel my name is Tina so in today's video I thought it would be fun to share a Hobby Lobby Christmas decor haul with you and I did get a little bit of footage when I was in the store so I will include that in the video and then we will come back here and I'll share what all I have picked up so far and I bought these over several weeks time just picking up a few things here and there but I am pretty pleased with what I've found so far and if I pick up some more items I'll just share them along the way in my decorating videos or maybe a random decor haul at some point but for right now let's jump on into the video. Something that I do want to purchase this year but I have not picked them out yet are some new stockings for my family. We've been using the same ones for many many years and they have seen better days. I'm just still trying to decide what direction I want to go if I want them all to match or if I want them just to coordinate but be a little bit different. That's what I'm leaning towards. So that's something I'm still thinking about and have to pick up. But they had some really pretty options. I certainly appreciate how Hobby Lobby organizes all of their Christmas decor. It makes it so much easier to find what you're looking for. The rustic bells were definitely on my wish list and as you can see on this day they were fully stocked and I was able to pick up one of those and since then I really wanted to get a couple more and check back and they were completely gone. So hopefully they'll get some more back in stock, but if not, at least I was able to get one set and miniature trees. There were so many pretty ones to choose from. So I think I'll go ahead and start with some of the picks and I picked two of these. It is a light green and it has a frosted glittery effect to them. You can adjust the stems on this one and I just thought it was really pretty and it does have a little bit of a glistening or glitter effect to it and it, the regular price was $2.99 so it was right around $1.50 and I picked up two of those. The next ones that I picked are these. I thought they were very pretty, very full. They have And as you can see, these are just green. They have plain pine cones. There's no glitter or anything. And they are a little bit fuller. The regular price was $3.99. Again, they were 50% off. So I picked up two of those. one that I picked up and probably my favorite is this one 
The leaves are very soft on this one. You can definitely adjust this one and flare it out as big as you want or leave it as tight as you want. I thought this one was just so, so pretty and would be a lot of fun tucked in so many different places. And the regular price was $2.99, so 50% off of that. And I think I ended up buying five of this one. So pretty. And here's several of them together. So I think I'll go ahead and stick with the other greenery items that I picked up. And I picked up one of these 10 inch mini wreaths. I just thought this one was so pretty. It has the hanger attached and it was regularly eight 99. And wouldn't a lot of these be pretty like on cabinet doors, maybe a hutch and just so many different ways you can use these little wreaths and I wish I would have picked up a couple of more of these. So that's definitely on my wish list, but I'm glad I got this one because I just think it's so pretty. And I picked up two different miniature trees and the first one is this one. It's a lighter green shade, very wispy look to it. Just very pretty and has the burlap wrapped bottom and it does have that glistening or glitter effect to it. And I only picked up one of these because I have a couple of them from last year. I just wanted to add another one to that and it was regularly priced at $4.99. Such a pretty little tree. Can tuck in so many different areas. And the other miniature tree that I picked up is this one. They actually have this one in three different sizes. This is the small size and the regular price was $15.99. I just love the realistic look that it has and I just really want to change out some of my other miniature trees for more trees that look like this one. Such a fun one. So next up, I did purchase two of the smaller sized signs just to put on shelves or tuck in different areas, maybe even hang inside a tobacco basket. I haven't decided yet what I'm gonna do with them. And so I picked up this one and the regular price was $9.99. Again, it was 50% off. And then the other one that I picked up is this one and it was regularly $8.99. Next up is something you can probably hear it as I'm trying to pick it up, are these rustic gold bells. And I just think these were so pretty. I actually looked for these again because I purchased these a long time ago and they actually had the smaller ones as well. And I wanted to get some of those and another one of these to add into different wreaths, but they were not in the store anymore. They were sold out. So I'm glad I at least got one, but the regular price was $17.99. Again, they were half price. So pretty. up from the craft section are these wood snowmen they come in a package of six they are natural wood and they are just so pretty the way they are but you could definitely do so many things with these in fact I picked up three packages of these because I have some other ideas in mind but I think they would make really fun ornaments really pretty on a tiered tray just so many ways you could use these these Christmas tree ornaments. They're a really good size. You get four in a package and they were regularly $2.49. They have kind of a whitewash look to them and you definitely jazz them up to do something a little bit different with them as well. But I thought these were a really great find to add to our Christmas tree. I picked up this package of red and white shatterproof ornaments. They were regularly $12.99. Again, they were half price. I'll show you a little bit better the detail on these. 
and I kind of want to get some more of these. They do have gold tops on them and a jute hanger. I just think these are really pretty and I'm wanting to incorporate a little more red this year. Another ornament that I picked up is this little natural wood tree. They do stand up on their own, so if you wanted to use them in a tiered tray, you could, or on a shelf. They had them in three different wood tones. They had a mid-tone, a dark tone, and then this light natural color. That's the one that I went with, and I picked up three of those, and the regular price was $3.99. And another ornament that got my attention was this tree. It has a bronze colored star, a black and white striped bow. I just thought this one was really pretty and could also be used on a tiered tray and it was regularly $2.99. So another item that I picked up, this is more home related, is this Christmas tree plate. It's by the Robert Stanley line. It was regularly $6.99, and it is a very pretty cream color with brown flecks throughout. They had some other colors as well, and when I was in the store when I bought this one, but I have not been able to find more of them in my store. So I was hoping to get some more of these to actually use on our Christmas table, but since I have not been able to find them, I may end up just setting a candle on it or maybe use it as a candy dish or something like that. But I and they had a lot of pretty throws in the store, but this is the one that definitely got my attention. It's very soft, white with black Christmas trees. And it was regularly $19.99, so it was right at $10. Such a fun little throw to add into our Christmas decor. So pretty. And this item led me to my ribbon choice, which is white with black trees. I just thought that would be fun to kind of tie them together. And I think I'm gonna use this on my Christmas tree and then have the throw nearby. But I picked up two rolls of this ribbon. And the ribbon was regularly $9.99. It's 30 feet in length. And just a fun one to add in to my have some smaller items left and all of these items I was thinking about using for either my chicken wire shelf or my tiered tray. So let me show you what I picked up so far for that. And I picked up this little hot cocoa sign. Thought it was so cute. Just the right size and it was regularly $4.99. I'll see if I can get it to focus a little bit better. I just thought this one was so cute. Another option that I picked up, also about hot cocoa, it says hot cocoa warm up here. Has the cup with the snowflake design and some snowflakes scattered about. And the sides are done in red and white stripes. I just thought this one was really pretty and it was regularly $3.99. So cute for a hot cocoa bar or to use on a tiered tray or even on a smaller shelf, just a fun one. It's black and white, it says Merry Christmas, and I just thought this was a fun little addition to kitchen decor. Whether I use it on my tiered tray or my chicken wire shelf or tuck it in a pot holder, I just thought this one was a lot of fun, and it was regularly $3.99. did pick up a wood riser and they had this in different colors. I think they had red, black, and white. I went ahead and picked up the white. It was regularly $3.49 and this will fit perfect on my tiered tray or even in my chicken wire shelf if I need to add a little bit of height to something. And so I picked up one of these. I also picked up this galvanized milk can. It says Merry Christmas on one side and it is plain on the other. So if you liked one side better than the other, you could just turn it around. But I thought this would be really pretty on my tiered tray. Could add some fun picks or something inside. And it was regularly $3.99. So I thought that would be a fun one to add into my tiered tray decor. And 
the last item that I have are these fun little candy pigs. They look like peppermint candies. And I picked up two of these. I thought these would be really fun on a tiered tray or a hot cocoa bar. And they were regularly $1.49. So they're right around 75 cents each. And I picked up two of these. I hope you enjoyed this video and seeing what I found at Hobby Lobby so far this year. I am going to be jumping right on into decorating our home for the Christmas season. So stay tuned for that because those videos will be coming up soon. And you're getting a little bit of a sneak peek because we do have our tree up. It's not decorated yet. And I do have a few wall decor pieces up as well. And I'm so looking forward to just getting everything decorated, fun and festive for the Christmas season. If you're new here, I would love it if you hit subscribe and hung around and like always, give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video to let me know, I'd really appreciate it. I hope you have a wonderful blessed day and thanks for watching.